Hello good people, hello, welcome back to Mining the World, the insane project where I am mining the entire Minecraft world. Last episode we tried to connect that hole to that hole and let's say that it was not the most successful thing ever. So today I want to punch something and punching things in this world is punching our old foe, the aquifer. So let's go back and work on the aquifer. My idea is to bring the beacon to this platform and start destroying a little bit more of the terrain of the world and then drain a little bit more of the aquifer. So that's the plan for today, that's the goal and well, let's go! I think I found there the part where the aquifer is closest to the surface, but that's not the way that I actually want to start training it. When I was actually mining in here, I noticed that this is actually a thin layer, but it's, it's not that thin that I want to mine underwater. So, the idea that I have is that I can actually start draining the aquifer around this small piece of land, and after I do that, I can mine this safely on dry land and then dry this section. And I will have a huge hole done in the middle of the aquifer. I think that's the best way to go. But uh, again, uh, we, we really need to have a view on the size of this aquifer. It's insane. This has been the hardest task so far in the series and will probably continue to be for a couple... Uh, of more episodes, but uh, well, uh, no, no point in, in be complaining. L let's keep going. Let's go back to work. There we go, there we go, another huge dent on our old for the aquifer. It's, it's crazy to think the amount of deep slate that there is in here and where we started because this aquifer really goes from there, which is more or less the layer 63, goes up until lower than zero. It's, it's impressive. There is also another huge milestone that we achieve if we come up here. It's we pass the million and a half blocks of stone. It's it's <laughs> it's an insane number. And th I I actually thought that uh, I want to give you some perspective on the amount of water that we are removing. So if we actually search here for sponges, I have used. 12,000 times the sponges. It's it's amazing that the amount of work that that we do on this aquifer. It's it's incredible and and it's still huge. There is that layer. There is still water on that layer. There is all of that water. 
we still will have a lot of work on the aquifer, but I am pretty satisfied with what we accomplished today. So, uh, well, next episode we are going to change gears, we are going to mine again some other area of the world and we are going to go back to our old foe, the aquifer again, because there is still a lot of work. Look at these crazy sand walls. Oh my god, this, this is a vision to behold. Thank you so much for all of the support that you guys have been showing. I really hope that you are enjoying and I also hope to see you on the next one.